Hello? Hello? Hey, how's it going? What's up everybody, this is Agent Redgrave, and I am about to play the Devil May Cry 5 demo. I I tell you, for all these years, I didn't think this game would ever come out, but here we are. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Uh, may look different depending on the angle, we recommend playing, we'll face the screen. Yeah, okay, that's cool. Uh... Jeez, I should have waited till after this. I was too excited. Till the image is barely visible. What image? Just that. Uh... Okay, okay. Just barely visible. And I can still somewhat make it out there. There we go. Uh, but yeah, very vaguely there. Barely visible. There we go. Auto assist. Fuck auto assist. Who needs it? Save settings and start the game. Yes, thank you. Oh my god, I'm so fucking excited. I cannot I cannot wait for this game to come out next month. I mean oh my god. It's been it's been a letter of freaking Oh yeah, there we go. There's Nero. I think we only play as Nero in this, if I'm not mistaken. Five. Oh, this is exciting. This is exciting. <laughs> I can't I can't believe I'm actually seeing this on my screen right now. Uh yeah, new game, obviously. Tips. Boost knuckle punch line skill that allows user to throw a punch with maximum propulsion. Yeah. I, I gotta say, when I saw the debut trailer, I was a little fr thrown off by the robotic arm. But at first, I couldn't tell if this was uh, a, a new character or a reboot Dante. But then, when I no when I saw the sword and then the arm, it's like, oh, geez, we're getting dates! Wow. That's it. No more wheels from here. All right, guess I'm walking then. Yo, yo, yo! Check it out. What? This is awesome. This is so awesome. I think it's his manifesto. Manifesto. Devil Breaker. Overture. Blue. Demolition. Shockwave. Punchline. Red. High flying haymaker. <laughs> okay, so the uh, yeah, the, the base controls are still pretty standard. Devil May Cry. Whoa, fuck. Is that a charge shot? Freaking Blue Rose has a lot more oomph. Okay. Let's keep going. Whoa. What was that? Okay, yeah, a lot like the Devil Bringer used to work. Red orbs. They look a lot more devilish this time around. Alright. Am I supposed to use the Devil Breaker on something specific? Hang on a moment. Looks like the speed skill, like from previous games or from four, is already uh, available. <laughs> Looks like a giant heart. Whoa, there's some demons. Okay. Press circle to attack with your double breaker. Taking damage during this attack will destroy your current double breaker. Oh, double triggers playing. Yeah. <laughs> 
Gotta let it out. Gotta let it out. Gotta let it out. Yeah, take that. You want some? Pull my devil trigger. What's this? To consume one devil breaker. Sever and detonate your arm, losing a devil breaker in your magazine. Slot. What are demons doing in a city like this? There's something to this place. Get in there! Whoa. Whoops. I'm an idiot. I forgot all about exceed. Oh, what's this now? Not making it easy for me, huh? Take all those things. Ah, green orbs. Okay, the red orbs look devilish. The, the that orb looks <laughs> that orb looks like it's some kind of alien. Arm would still be a, would just be a regular guy. Yeah, right. Ooh, are these the hells? Yeah, I haven't seen you guys since DMC three. Oh, you mother! Oh, there's another arm there. Cool. What's this one? Equipped. Fire shockwave in front of you. Press. Whoa. Well, this looks fancy. Hey, Barky, can I... Really, guys? R really? Interrupting a brother when he's about to get a drink? Brother. Yes, now. Cycle through the arms. Yeah. 
Oh well. I'll try to find out when I play the main game. Ooh, S rank. I actually got S rank. And frustration is getting bigger. Bang, bang, bang. Oh. I'm gonna say blow my devil trigger. Ugh, jeez. That doesn't sound like you know I know at all. I love how they actually gave Dante and Nero like freaking holstering their weapon anim anim animations this time around. Ooh. That is cool. Jeez, this is some crazy demonic infestation going on here. Look at this. Man, I got I gotta say, I mean, just fr freaking look at Nero here. I mean, look, just think back to DMC one. Look how far the series has come in terms of like, well, everything, gaming in general. Just look at this. I mean, yeah, okay, this stuff is all covered in, uh, like I said, some crazy demonic infestation. But graphically, you gotta admit. This place actually looks kind of pretty. Or not. Get over here! I am a badass, thank you. Get over here! That was that it? What's this? Tree root obstacles. Drop a parasitic hatchling into a demon tree root in your path to proceed forward. Look for hatchlings somewhere nearby. Uh, is this? I mean, where, would I, where would I find one of those hatchlings? Is that it? Ugh! It's gross! Demonic bugs. Oh, Jesus, look at that thing. I fucking love the more urban tone this one's got. I mean, look at it. That 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 is one thing about the reboot. I am glad that was carried over was a more urban aesthetic, without all the oversaturated colors. Because let me tell you, playing the, the DMC reboot actually hurt my eyes sometimes. At least back when I first got the game. Just in case that blows up. We're good. Come on, Nero, let's go. I'm gonna lie. This new arm is pretty sweet. Yeah, so, uh... At least your demon arm was organic. Uh, then again, I suppose the robot arm is easier to explain in public. People will just be freaked out about how... Hello? It's Clark Kent. I guess the phone still works. Took you long enough, dumbass. What happened to the third ring room? Tell you what. You call me from now on, and I'll hustle on over. Whoa. <laughs> the, who gave her a license? Calling Nico. You can call Nico's trailer where you can trade red orbs for skills. 
Okay, okay. So instead of divinity statues, we call Nico. And all right, all right. Hmm. That's actually kind of cool. Oh wait. Green orbs. Give me the green orbs. Mahahaha. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. This thing is too prepared. I heavily, heavily agree. Let's see what we got here. Okay, I get all this. Alright, let's get the air hike because... Let me tell you, classic uh, Devil May Cry games. Oh, wait. Oh, I wouldn't be able to afford that anyway. Uh, can't get that. Oh, no, no, no. Let's move up. Oh, okay, jeez. I'm an idiot. Uh... You know, I really like the overture. Just the one. You need anything else? No, that's about it. Okay, I think we got the, the general idea of customization. Saving. Yeah, that makes a lot of, Yeah, that's really important for a demo. Uh, uh, okay, well, clearly... Clearly that's not a devil trigger, so I'm wondering if Nero is even going to have a devil trigger in this game that I think about it. Uh, a little mix on that. Whoa. Wait, is this where... Ooh, I think we're about to have a boss fight. Ho ho ho. Okay. Let's try this. I think it's Goliath. Is it Goliath? Whoa. He just happened to land in the open door. I mean, now that it would hurt me. Call a doctor? Alright, here's the Goliath. At least that's what his, his name was has been all along. I'm not sure if it's changed since. Sorry to disappoint you. Hey, you happen to see a guy around here? About this big, uses a cane? I was supposed to meet him. Did you snack on him? Your blood uh, is a very precious sacrifice. Eating you would do me no good. I must have every last drop to rule the underworld. King. Seriously? King? You? I don't know. I mean, you're a big guy and all, but you seem more like a knuckle scrapping fart in the wind than anything else. Yeah, no offense. Or a turd in the wind? <laughs> uh, I actually like the Venom movie. Oh boy. Now that is good. Cool. Ooh. Dodge Nero. <laughs> cool trick. Hey, do you do parties? Okay, yeah. They, they made Nero even cooler in this game than he was in the fourth game. I mean. Nero's kind of the, the rookie kid who you're like, okay, yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's play as Dante. Yeah, maybe I will. Sorry, I'm about to kill you. Okay. Is that how it is? Okay. Shit. Shit! 
He's a lot tougher than the Devil May Cry 3 or 4 bosses. Either that or I'm out of practice. Actually, if it's if the Devil Breaker works anything like the Devil Bringer, you should probably only use it on bosses when they're stunned. I didn't think about that. Why? Uh, Nero. Ooh. Jeez. Grab some uh, double stars. Ho oh, ho! Alrighty. Let's do this. See, I got I got some green orbs, and I almost got went back to full health. Then I got cocky, and look what happened. Show me. Whoa. Oh, Nelly. His stomach is a fucking void. Uh oh. Oh, Nelly. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Oh. Now look what happened. Kick your ass. Okay, well, he did uh, manage to slap me around a bit, but you know, uh, I, I beat him. Yeah, I doubt it. Oh, there we go. Alright, how bad did I do? How bad did I do? D rank. Oh, oh, I got an A! Hey! Well, I tell you, I actually got an A. Whew. Okay. Wow. Um, the only negative I have to say about the demo itself, not the game itself really, but the demo, was only getting to play as Nero. Now, I'm not hating on Nero at all. Honestly, I actually like Nero. Uh, I I've liked him since the fir fir first one. Fourth one, but not as much as Dante, but uh, anyway. 
Uh, I would like to try out a bit of Dante's gameplay in this in, in for five as well as V. But you know, it is what it is. I uh, got a sense of what the game's like. Uh, I gotta say, <laughs> it's you know who's been the, the series main director since two has been saying that this is probably the best action game he's ever made. I don't know. I mean, I want to place my standards low. So I, I I think the game is gonna be great. Don't get me wrong, but I'm thinking this could be this could replace Devil May Cry 3 as the best game in the series because it everything just looks so fucking awesome. I I love the music. I love the I, I like the sort of urban realistic setting they're going for this time around as opposed to some some of the more anime esque uh, vibes the series has had in three and four especially. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, says the guy whose favorite game has been Devil May Cry 3 for like, I don't know, over a decade now. A uh, decade, almost a decade and a half now. Um, yeah, uh, gotta say, uh, it's hard to believe this game's finally happening after all these years. When, as soon as I, the second I saw the reboot, the, 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 tra te the debut trailer for the reboot, I thought this game would never come out. And now, after 11, almost 11 years, or it's finally happening... I, I can't tell you, I've never been this excited for a video game before. Wow. Just, wow. Devil May Cry is back. Well, see you later, people. Peace.